also came up with those things. They have to get on their private notes to get living some cereal to get me a pop and to feed the animals in the bathroom. Since we are out of cat food for the time being, Kim is still sleeping, watching Rap Card Diaries and Laundry started. His camp is hard. So, yeah. Okay, I'm still full of easy hospital call. I got everything that I needed for my glucose appointment. And guess what? It's on Halloween. Not only is it my grandmother's death date, it's Amanda's court date. And I get my blood drawn and I get a shot on Halloween. It's going to be a sucky Halloween, but we're going to try and make it good. Caleb's in the bathroom. So, yeah. Okay, guys. So, like I said, I don't know what this video holds. Caleb's trying to fill out application at Dollar General, but it's a lot harder. Yeah, that is a lot faster. A lot harder than he thought. He can't use my phone because oh, he's got to... If he used my phone, he would have to log into everything on of his, and then my phone would be slow as fuck. Um, I just got off the phone with the hospital. Finally got my um, glucose thing figured out, but guess what? It's on Halloween, when it's my grandmother's year death date, Amanda's next court date, and that court day will determine if she loses all rights to Salem or not. Um, which, if you guys want my opinion on that, I think she's honestly doing great since she got out of treatment. But it's not up to me, it's up to the courts. And then I have my doctor's appointment where I get my blood drawn and then I get a shot. <coughs> or I get my shot and then I get blood drawn. Either fucking way, I'm gonna have to get poked twice, and either fucking way, I'm gonna be in pain, but I'm going to try and make it the best Halloween ever for my kids. It's going to be cold, so this is the plan for Halloween. We're going to take them to the stores during the day and see family in their costumes during the day. We are not gonna go um, trick-or-treating because it is going to be extremely cold, and with me recovering from a sickness and me being pregnant and with the girls being young, we just do not feel like it's a good idea to take them out. So that's what the plan is for Halloween. I will make sure I will take plenty of pictures. Um, and everything. And as for Josh and Cassie... Um, they're expecting a baby. She's approximately 14 weeks. Um, I did message her on Messenger. I didn't get anything in return. And I also commented on Josh's post and Cassie's post. And I still didn't get a reply. So I don't know if Cassie's just being a little immature bitch and really does not want to let things go. Or... If she just hasn't found the time to text me back. But she's dating my cousin and possibly going to be marrying him. And I want to be part of the baby's life and Josh's life. I could give two fucks left if I'm a part of her actual life. I just want to be a part of the baby's life and his life. So I'll try to be nice to her and I will try to reach out. As much as I can. Um, <laughs> I'm showing more initiative than any of my other fucking family members are, to be honest. Like, the in complete Vancura side of the family don't talk to each other. Ashley and I are, be are growing more and more distant. Amanda and I are growing more and more distant. My brothers and I are growing more and more distant. I don't have any fucking family besides Caleb's family to really accept me and listen to what I have to say. So, it's whatever at this point. I'm going to go take care of my kid now. So, yeah.
Okay, so I have those two loads of laundry. I'm quite literally almost done with laundry. Um, my dad has some laundry up above the garage. That he makes me do. So. Yeah, right. Literally after that, that, and that, and after this load is set in the dryer. I will have laundry completed. Caleb ran to the store for my dad real quick to get plastic. So yeah. Okay you guys, so Grandma Janet um, sent Caleb and I and Jaylin a little package. We're gonna open it. Oh, and I'm washing all of um, her clothes, and we're going to start putting some stuff away. So, it comes with this little garment bag. Oh, this is so cute. But I'm going to wash all of her clothes together, so like, that'll be one load. And then, in this little garment bag, bag we have a smaller bag oh they're washcloths so we have washcloths and another little hat. That's cute. I'm gonna keep this bag for something. Some little ribbon. Okay, I like this garment bag, so I'm gonna try not. I like this, so we're gonna keep it. We're gonna wash it as well. So, in this, they're all zero to three months, by the way. We have a little bib, little cardigan, little onesie, and the pants. Thank you, Grandma Janet, if you're watching this. So, I love you guys, and I'll catch you guys here in a little bit. Okay, so I have to clean up a little bit of a mess in Ziba's playpen uh, or crib. Other than that, everything's good. Caleb's going to supper, grabbing spaghetti and garlic bread. Um, due to me not feeling the best and puking, mac and cheese is not on the table. And, um,. <coughs> And the last time I ate a pizza, it fucked with my stomach, so I don't know what I'm going to have to eat. Um, so I'm having a little bit of an issue determining that. But... <laughs> Caleb's currently bringing me more laundry now. Um, plastic is on the windows, besides the ones in the pantry and one in the, um, bathroom. Colin was here for a little bit, he went to go get the girls, um, see if it's gonna have 
some spaghetti and some garlic bread and then yeah I still don't I don't know what I'm gonna have um Stormy's doing an amazing job um the doctor prescribed me these meds I take it twice and like one today and like one in three days is terrible with my yeast infection so yeah love you guys I'll catch you guys in a little bit Okay, so we just had supper. I had ramen and a piece of garlic bread and everyone else had spaghetti. Ziva devoured it. She's currently upstairs with her dad. Um, I did my dad's blanket with two eyes, so the next time I go upstairs, I will bring it up to him. It's 4.39. Still watching Vampire Diaries. Switched over laundry. Probably on my last vlog for the night, so yeah, love you guys, and I'll catch you guys in a little bit. Okay, so I'm just gonna decide. I decided I want to dye my hair, so I'm gonna grab two things or gloves, and since you, my hair is already red. I'm going back in with the red. I don't have to bleach it or anything. So, yeah. Give me one second, you guys. I have to go shut it up. Yeah. Hopefully it turns out good. I think it turned out great. 